Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to use the receiving and inventory tracker template. To do that, you need to go on the template option on your left panel. Once you're here, you need to scroll down and click on view templates for the receiving and inventory tracker. Once you've reached here, all you need to do is click on the add to account on the top right corner. Once you've done that, the receiving and inventory tracker module has been added to your workspace. Now to set up the receiving and inventory tracker, you need to go on the location mastercard and you can add locations by clicking on forms. So these will be locations where your goods will be present in the store. So it can be rack one, After this, you need to um, go to I item masters and click on the form and you can start adding your items here. So brand can be XYZ brand, item can be white t-shirt, color will be white and size can be S. also go on enter data and add multiple data together or you can upload an excel uh, file as well which will uh, upload all the data for you so with that we've entered data into our item masters and we've also entered uh, data into our location master and now what we're going to do is we're going to be checking in items and checking out items on our app and then we're going to come back and see the dashboard over here. Hi guys, now we're here on the app and you can see that the receiving and inventory tracker module is already available. We're going to click on it. Here the shop crew members will only be able to see the check in and check out option. Only if access is given to them, will they be able to see the location and item masters. So we're going to go ahead and click on check in select the brand select an item add a description if required and then select a rack put in the quantity and submit it now to check out the inventory we're going to go on the checkout option click on a location here you can see that all the other fields are getting auto-filled. Then we can put a quantity we want to check out and press submit. All right, now we're back on the web page and we're going to go to the dashboard option on the left panel and we're going to go to the receiving and inventory tracker dashboard. Once you're here, you need to just refresh it once and you can see all the information come up. If you remember, we had put a check-in of about 150 shirts and a checkout of 50. So you can see the available stock over here. What you can also do is filter from racks, filter by brand options, or even filter by the items and see uh, what quantity you have available and uh, where they are placed. So with this, you can check the receivables, where the inventory is kept, how much inventory is left, and basically track all of it on the dashboard. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you.